Hi, um, I am AnimatorXP and today I'm going to corrupt Pac-Man for the NES using a wine source ROM Corruptor. It's a tool to corrupt NES games or actually all games, <laughs> not just NES games, they're just the easiest ones to corrupt. And then um, today I'm going to corrupt Pac-Man because um, as you probably know, or maybe you don't know, I don't know, I have also corrupted the um, Super Mario Brothers and the Legend of Zelda using this, but um, those videos were very different. Uh, I didn't talk over them and there was no webcam. But then um, let's get started. Uh, first, I'm going to just try. I have already made a corruption, corruption setting here. I know it works and I actually know also, also know what it do, does because I used it right before. But um, Let's try it anyway. So I'm going to click down here on the run button, and I don't know if you can actually see my cursor. I don't think you can, but I'm going to click the run button down here, and uh, yeah. Now you can see Pac-Man coming up right here, and I will start play. Uh, if it won't work, yeah, now it comes, but it just starts like this for some reason. I don't know why it starts like that. And then the start screen just comes up again. It's pretty weird. <laughs> what? I, I didn't really expect that. That was like a pink ghost flying by the screen. I'm just like going to try starting it one more time. What? <laughs> this is so random. <laughs> why is there a random ghost looking at me up there? I don't know. But well, let's try once again. This is pretty weird. What? Is that like a, a Pac-Man up, up there? Uh, I don't know where I'm pointing. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I will try one more time. What is even going on? It's just so weird. Like up there is just Pac-Man. Uh, no. Whatever. Let's try again. I just can't stop trying. Because, okay, I don't think anything new is going to happen now, but that's pretty weird. <laughs> what do I'm going to? Shut down the NES thingy and come with another corruption. Um, oh, here you can like control what bytes and stuff it uh, should corrupt. Right now I have the start byte at 700 and the end byte at 1000 and the increment at 1000 and corrupt every 20th byte. And it adds one every byte it corrupts. So uh, yeah, I'm going to try changing it that a little bit. To like corrupt area hmm. 30, but then um, add 3 bytes every time, and then maybe start at 600. And now it should be a different result when I click run. Run, show the H in yes, and yeah, let's try and just and see what's going to happen this time around. Yeah, and I'm just very quickly just going to do so that you can... Hey, what? What's going on? What? Okay, I didn't really... I was try trying to make you so that you see all of the screen, but... This is pretty weird. Why is the screen red? Okay, let's... Okay, I can't do anything. It doesn't seem like... Um, I'm just going to try running that again. Um, like that. Now I'm going to try pressing start. Okay. Let's start. What? It just. I lost automatically or something. There's no Pac Man. Pac Man is disappeared. What's. Go okay, this is. <laughs> What's even going on? I don't know. It says. Okay. Let's try one more time. <laughs> this is pretty weird. I'm going to do like, yeah, like that, and then, um, okay, this time I'll try, I think this is probably going to press the game, but I'll try corrupting every 5 and add 10 to each byte, and this is, it probably won't run, but I'll try to see if it, if I'm very lucky, yeah, okay, it runs, and um, let's see how the game look. okay, does not really run. Okay, what's the even saying of that? Run T V D explanation point. Pure. Okay, this is pretty random. Um 
that was a bit too much maybe I changed it. Let's just set this down to 1 maybe and then it's up to 40. Now I hope it will at least be playable because now I've changed the value around so it isn't such a huge corruption. Let's try and see if I can actually play the game this time. Okay. Okay, that was pretty creepy. <laughs> what was that all about? Okay, just a scary sound. It was Pac-Man Jumpscare Edition. Let's maybe make it even more, uh, even less effective, the corruption uh, by seeing us up to 50, uh, 60 instead of 40. Now I hope it will work. Come on. Oh, something is happening here. Pac-Man, what is Rick Ghost doing on top of the maze? And why am I un unable to do anything? Uh, it crashed, okay. Uh, no, it hasn't crashed because the one of thing thing is blinking. I don't know what's going on, but I can't move and nothing moves. So, well, let's try another one. <laughs> this is just pretty weird. Um, I'll try to make it even less so that effective so that I maybe can move. Um, by setting it, what about uh, adding a uh, shift right one? That, I think that will maybe. I don't know what it's going to do. Let's just try it out. Maybe it doesn't even do anything. Uh, okay, it makes a black screen. That was pretty boring. Let's try something else. Uh, what about corrupt every thick uh, and um, add five. This should be be pretty crazy. But I don't know, maybe it will just be completely normal and nothing. Okay. Well, I'm getting a lot of black screens. Let's <laughs> try corrupting it a little bit less. It was more exciting in the beginning, it seems like. Maybe I should put this up to 700 instead, then it won't corrupt the beginning of the game. And I'll maybe be able to start it up. Okay, I have a music player of some kind. You just try waiting and see if it will show like the ghost personality screen thing. Uh, yeah, okay, it does. It's just completely normal. Let's. Okay, I'm just gonna shut this one down. What? what? <laughs> okay, it's not completely normal. What? Okay! I'm happy I didn't just shut that one down. It's pretty weird, whatever, but let's try something else. Um, corrupt by adding... What about adding 50? <laughs> I, this won't run, but let's try. Uh, okay, it ran. Let's... Oh, this one looks kind of like the first one. What? What's going on? Why is it showing off the cutscenes? That doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Yeah. Okay. That made sense, I guess. Let's try another one. It's pretty weird. Um, crop every 20th byte. Run. I don't know what this is going to do. Um, Okay, it seems like it's the same thing as before. Well, no it's not because it doesn't show the second cutscene. And now it just shows the number one, I think. Or maybe that's like flags. <laughs> I don't know what that is, it's pretty weird. Let's try something else. Um, what about instead of adding 50, then we replace all of the by saying 5 with all by saying 9 then I hope something different will happen this time or maybe it just won't work okay it works let's try and see what's going to happen this seems pretty normal well uh, yeah it seems completely normal ultimate can be normal I just think that this is normal headman nothing better left but that's unfortunate that we can't get any real guitar effects, whatever. 
Let's try maybe corrupting a, a little bit more. Let's corrupt every single byte. Then something should happen. If not, then we are pretty unlucky. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going to turn a little bit down for Pac-Man because the volume is pretty loud. I don't think anything happens. That's well, unfortunate. Uh, maybe I should try replacing zeros with ones because I think there are a lot more zeros than nines and fives. Okay. Okay, <laughs> that did something. Uh, Pac-Man has turned all satanic and red and stuff and it froze. That's unfortunate. Let's just try that one more time and see the ghost screen. <clears throat> then we just have to wait a little bit and it should appear. <laughs> or maybe it won't. Maybe it does. Yeah, now it comes. Shadow, yeah, it seems completely normal. Other than open high school thingy, it like shows uh, what what just happened right down. What's going on? Why are the ghosts just in black? Well, that's weird. Whatever. Let's try one more time because this is pretty entertaining. Um, and I'm going to try to completely change this stuff up and make this into 1200 and this one up to 900 and then add one to every single byte. This probably won't run. Okay, it does. That's cool, I guess. Um, okay, it doesn't run. You can't. I can't press anything. Whatever. Let's try with a little bit less corrupt only your fifth byte instead of every single one. Then it will maybe run. It shows a black screen. That's unfortunate. Uh, let's try <laughs> to corrupt every tenth byte. That will possibly work. But I'm not sure, of course, because. <laughs> Yeah, okay, it won't work. Let's just maybe change it down a little bit. But you know what? I think that this is it for this video. Um, I will make more videos soon. So yeah, bye.